dear students a very good morning let's continue our syllabus in part 1 of lesson number 3 that is part of computer we have already done four main parts of computer that are monitor cpu keyboard and mouse now in this part that is part 2 for the same lesson we will study additional devices it's on page number 26 additional devices what are they you can add some more parts to computer you can add some more parts to a computer if required they are not like main parts main part monitor cpu keyboard mouse they are not like main parts which are important for using computer they are attached to a computer only if we need them okay children so what we do we add them if we require then we add some more parts to computer as we are adding we are adding some parts so that is why they are known as additional devices clear children now let's have a look on them first of all there are three additional devices what are they printer scanner speakers printer scanner speakers first is printer see the picture on your screen this is how printer looks like now what printer do printer helps to print out a document on a sheet of paper read the sentence on your screen printer is used to print whatever is displayed on the monitor so children whatever is there on your monitor printer print that for example suppose you have written a poem in a computer or done a drawing or some school work anything just click on print button what printer will do printer will write or draw all your work on a paper and give to you as a print out okay just try to understand okay now i highlighted the monitor part just try to understand how printer works first look at the computer okay one child made a drawing on it can you see that drawing very beautiful drawing of fruit and vegetable banana and peas so they have made one child had made this drawing now for taking out the print on paper printer is attached as you can see the printer is attached can you see the printer yes and print out of the drawing is out as output by printer the same drawing is coming out on the paper from the printer okay so one child had made a drawing on the monitor can you uh, on the monitor screen then on from computer they are taking the print out with the help of printer the same drawing is coming on the piece of paper okay i think you all understand now okay children <coughs> so this is how printer work now printer is mainly of three types now there are three types of printers okay so printer are of three types now we are we have studied how printer works what printer do for us 
why we add printer to computer we add printer to our computer so that whatever we do on computer like we are making a document we have written a poem so we can take out the printout printout means whatever we have written on the monitor screen we can the printer can draw or write those things on a piece of paper and give it to us okay now printer are of three types laser inkjet dot matrix laser inkjet dot matrix look at them one by one laser printer this is how laser printer looks like laser printer next one is inkjet this is how inkjet looks like and the last one is dot matrix. This is how dot matrix looks like. So how many types of printers are there? Three types of printers. Laser, inkjet, dot matrix. Clear children? So let's move further. Next on page number... 27 scanner and speakers so now what are they we are done with printer printers is to take out the print whatever display on the monitor there are three types laser inkjet dot matrix now what is scanner and speaker scanner first have look on its picture this is how scanner look like okay it is used to send pictures or text that is any document into the computer what it will do it will copy and send the document or picture into the computer uh, for better understanding uh, let's suppose you have one photo of yours now you what you want you want to put that photo into computer okay you have one photo of yours you have to put that photo into computer then how you can you do that with the help of scanner okay with the help of scanner just use scanner and you can put that photo or any uh, document or suppose you have written a poem on a piece of paper you want to put that paper in, into the computer so that also you can do it with the help of scanner so how you can do that you just have to place your photo or paper on the scanner suppose you have photo or you have written a poem on paper so how you can put that photograph or paper uh, a poem uh, which you have written on paper how you can put in into the computer with the help of scanner how scanner work what you have to do you have to place your photo on scanner as you can see on your screen the way a man is doing in the picture right and that's it your photo or document or text whatever paper will come into your computer okay children uh, for uh, let me get a simple example uh, i'm sure that you uh, everyone have seen the photostate machine right how it works the xerox pro process the photostate machine how it works we place a document or a book on the machine and we get a copy of that on a sheet of paper. Same as it is with scanner. It is used for copying and sending things into the computer. Only difference between photostate machine and scanner is photo scanner is used to send document into the computer. And in photostate machine, we get the output on piece of paper right clear 
very easy and very useful too next is speaker this is how speakers look like read the sentence speakers are used to listen to music speech or other sounds from the computer okay uh, if we want to listen to music or if we are watching cartoons or movie on computer then how can we hear to the audio with the help of speakers for example in school in your school each and every class is having speaker right in corridor in music room yoga room dance room there are speakers so when it is raining outside uh, uh, then we have our morning prayers or assemblies inside the classrooms then how did we listen to morning prayers with the help of speakers when sometime our school principal our sister wants to inform regarding some important notice or some points how do we hear that with the help of speakers so with the help of speakers we can listen to music speech or other sounds okay children so we are done with three additional devices printer scanner speaker okay so chapter is over now we are left with book exercise and question answers which we will continue in our next section thank you children